My name is Hala. This is Mr. Kitty. <laughs> and this is my sister Liana. And we're making a video for Kim Catfinder to let you guys know how she helped us find Mr. Kitty. Okay, so uh, we lost Mr. Kitty on May 6th. We were looking for 29 days up until he was found. 29 days, um, we hiked, we set up traps, caught the wrong cats, we did all the things that we weren't supposed to do. We yelled his name. Threw litter all over the driveway. Threw litter all over the driveway. Uh, we didn't know. <laughs> and so um, Liana told me about Kim Catfinder maybe three days into us losing Mr. Kitty. But at that time, I was like, no, we can do it on our own. We had no idea how long and painful the process would be so two weeks after when we were kind of just giving up we had already spent so much money on posters and traps and view so we decided to purchase the program where um, I get one-on-one -on -one coaching with her and um, you know she makes flyers for me and helps me with everything at that point I was just ready to give up I didn't want to keep going grief Kim, avoidance grief avoidance Kim, uh, Kim made me the flyers I laminated them we kept putting posters up the last neighborhood we tried to put flyers and posters in I walk outside and I see this rainbow and I hand out my very last flyer to one of my neighbors who I had never even talked to prior to us losing Mr. Kitty so there had been this crazy story. There had been another cat that looked just like him that was roaming around the neighborhood. And we had had so many of these calls and texts that we didn't, I didn't believe it. Yeah. We were just like, I was like, whatever. Because Kim coached me and told me to ask for a picture right away, I got a picture and... Very blurry. Very blurry picture, but I knew immediately that it was him. We went right away to go get Mr. Kitty. I tried to stay very, very calm, picked him up, finally got him, and he was back with us after 29 days. I think it's safe to say we had absolutely given up at that point. And so thanks to Kim's help, we were able to just kind of keep going. And you know, in her booklet, she talks about staying positive, and I kept rereading those stories and stuff and like that. She also talks about what to do when your cat is back. Like, yes, yeah. yeah. So we've Which been has been very important because he was kind of sick and throwing up. So it was important to know what to do after he came home. Yeah. So we've been refeeding him. I was texting Kim when he was getting his blood work. She knows what to look for, what to ask the doctor, the vet, and so we're very, very thankful to her. And do you want to tell long them? story? Anyway, we bought these party <laughs> hats after a week when he went missing in order to encourage us to keep going so we would celebrate when he came back. And so that's our thank story. Thank you, Kim. Thank you, Couldn't Kim. Have done it without you. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank for you for bringing home our little man. We're so happy.